Hello YouTube. We're here making some delicious pulled pork crispy sandwiches with some Walmart fresh French bread sliced pretty thick and buttered. Buttered on both sides. Gives it a really great flavor. Got some shredded cheese also by Walmart, whatever, shredded mozzarella, whatever works. Some butter, butter both sides. And the big thing is pulled pork. We just happened to go to a wedding and they gave us a ton of pulled pork because <laughs> they didn't know what to do with it. So my wife figured out these delicious crispy sandwiches. And the secret ingredient to this whole process is the George Foreman grill. I know everyone kind of laughs at the George Foreman grill, but I'll tell you when you reheat stuff like pizza or you want a crispy grilled cheese sandwich, it's delicious. So it's probably one of the best investments we ever made. We didn't buy it for losing weight, but it does reheat food really well. So this is a very simple process. So you already buttered the bread. Just gonna add some pulled pork. Sprinkled cheese, mozzarella and cheddar mix, shredded. Our griddle isn't hot, so we're gonna, not going to be able to put it in yet, so we'll prepare yep. three of these together. Yeah, we're heating up the griddle. It's got it on maximum, for maximum crispiness. Right. Couldn't be simpler. Had some of these last night, they were so good. If you're Muslim, I suppose you could substitute some shredded beef for the pork. Or Jewish. Exactly. <laughs> Delicious heated pulled pork. She just warmed this up a little bit in the microwave. It was frozen. There they are. About a tablespoon of shredded cheese. And then the bottoms are right here. And you just put it on top, but I'm not going to do that because I don't want my counter all yucky. So I'll wait till the griddle's up. All right. All right, we're back. Our grill has reached optimum cooking temperature. It only takes a couple of minutes. And there we go. Butter on the outside. Delicious pork and cheese on the inside. Ooh, I got three of these guys. Get three of them on there. Nice. And we're gonna clamp that puppy down. And squish. Squish it down. Have a nice textured top, and it's all done, nice and brown. How many minutes do you think for a fully heated, heated griddle like this? Probably four minutes. Four or five minutes. Okay. All right, so we will set a timer and we will be back in about four or five minutes. All right, so it's been about three minutes. We're just gonna pop the lid up, take a look. Oh, they could go a little longer. They're lightly browned. Let's check the bottom though. All right, she's checking the bottom. We don't wanna burn them. Ah, oh, they're okay. good. Yeah, the bottom's done. Top's pretty good, I guess. I guess you don't really have to heat them for very long. Nope. Just enough to melt the butter and toast them. Look at those. All right, there you have it. Kind of looks like French toast. Delicious toasted pulled pork sandwiches on French bread and butter. Mm -mm. Give it a try. Pretty easy to make and they taste delicious. Very good. Hey, YouTube. Just pop it in one more time just to say how delicious this sandwich is. Do you like hot, toasty, crispy bread with some nice meat flavoring, some cheese in there? Absolutely delicious.